come to the viewers now we discuss degree of vertex in graph theory if we consider g be the graph and if v dash j be the vertex of g then we can say the degree of vertex as denoted by d of v dash j is defined as the number of edges incident with the vertex of v j now let's see what's happened there if we consider a graph and it is a pictorial representation see v dash 1 and v2 dash be the two vertices uh, that's incident with the edges e1 e1 dash if we consider it then we easily find d of v dash 1 is equal to d of v dash 2 that will be 1 so it is clear that it is degree of vertex the degree of vertex of v dash 1 is 1 v dash 2 is 1 if any edge incident with vertex as a loop then we assume degree of is of this vertex is 2 if we consider another figure here v1 v2 v3 dash v4 dash v3 dash v4 dash now v1 dash v2 dash are connected with two parallel edges u1 dash and e2 dash here v5 dash is connected with two parallel edges e5 dash and e6 dash here in v3 dash this has have a loop and connected with two non parallel edges e3 dash and e6 dash v4 is connected with two non parallel edges incident with two non parallel edges, uh, edges that will be e4 dash and e6 dash that's all are incidents with this type of graph that is represented in this figure 1 now we have to find the degree of vertices d of v1 dash that will 3 v1 dash that means two parallel edges that is degree 2 and one non parallel edges that is degree 3 d of v2 dash that is 1 v2 dash 1 to 2 non parallel edges and here two parallel edges so 4 d of degree of v3 dash that will also be 4 v3 dash because one loop containing two edges and two non parallel edges degree of v4 dash v4 dash that is two non parallel edges so it will be two degree of v5 dash it has two non uh, it has uh, degree of v5 dash it has two non parallel edges that is two now we consider here one terms if the degree of vertex is odd then it's declared as odd vertex and if it is even it declared as even vertex so in the earlier representations here degree of vertex that is odd vertex v1 dash is odd vertex v2 dash even v3 dash even v4 dash even and v5 dash also even now pendant vertex if v dash j be the vertex of the graph g such that degree of v dash j is 1 then we declare as pendant vertex in the earlier figure we also find here d of v1 dash and d of v2 dash is 1 so these two are pendant vertex now next terms we consider degree sequence now if we are going to the definitions if we list the degree of all the vertices of a graph in a non decreasing order we get degree sequence of degree sequence in g so if we list the all degree of all the vertices of a graph in a non decreasing order we get degree sequence in g so degree sequence of figure 1 we find here so non decreasing order so we start from 2 then we start 3 4 in this way so the required order will be degree of vertices of v4 that is 2 2 next is 3 then next is 4 and 4 so degree sequence required degree sequence will 2 2 3 4 4 here it is 2 here it is 2 so 2 2 next is 3 then 4 here 4 then 4 so in this find the degree sequence of the vertices so we get some of the ideas about degree of vertices odd vertex and even vertex pendant vertex decrease degree sequence of a graph and here we consider all the graphs that is not die graph or directed graph that is all are undirected graph. Now we end our discussions.
regarding few important terms related with graph theory. If you like this video, like it, share it and subscribe the channel and if you have any suggestions for development, then comment it. Thanks for watching.